Hello everyone, welcome back to Dead Cells, in which I'm having trouble starting and stopping my recording, so at the end of this episode, do expect me to go, oh, how do I stop this, and forget why it's not working, but we're just going to play. Apologies for the delay, and I hope that you are um, appreciating the other series, which we call the other series. Uh, oh, what's up? Let's do this. Um, the, 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 the series of... Darkest Dungeon. Look, they all begin with D and it really confuses me. So I'm okay with these. Oh, my voice. Why is my voice going? How long has it been since. Oh, yeah. That's good. I like that. Right. How long has it been? A, since I played the game, because I've apparently I've forgotten how. So this is going to be a quick run, and then we're going to do another one. Probably straight away afterwards. Um, since I was complaining about my voice in a recent episode. Uh, about a week, maybe? And here I am, yet again, still unable to speak. Which doesn't really fill me full of confidence. I don't feel unwell. There's no real... There's nothing about... Roll. Roll. What is happening here? Get out of it. There we go. You seem just not roll. Ha <laughs> right. We'll remember how to play this game within maybe a couple of minutes, by which time it'll be far too late. Let's go a tactics run. I have had some advice, but I've forgotten it all. Uh, apart from the obvious advice, pay some damn attention and stop just failing at everything that you do. But, you know, that is general life advice and easier said than done in many cases. So I thank you for your input. Maybe a little bit less irony next time. Where am I going? Help me out. We do want cells, so it's not the end of the world that we're spending so much time on this floor. Although, obviously, cells are available on the next floor if we take less time. This being said. Oh, I do remember some advice. This was fairly pointed out, although I'm not entirely 100% sure whether implementing it is the correct way to go. Um, do I want a close-range bow? I don't think I do. Although the twin daggers are not my favourite. I think two essentially ranged attacks are not the greatest idea, all in all. Um... It was pointed out that since a 2 plus is the same as a 4, I should take a 4 and replace it with... Um, like, re-roll the stats on it, upgrade it when I get to the blacksmith. And then, of course, I've got a 4 plus, which is better than a 2 plus, right? This is fine, except oftentimes when I'm not replacing a 2 plus with a 4, it's because the stuff on the... Four is not good enough, in my humble opinion, which is very humble indeed, don't you dare suggest otherwise. My humblest opinion is the most humblest you can possibly be, and no messing. I, I feel it would possibly cost a fair amount of money. I'm not really using the Frost Blast properly, so let's use a Firebrand instead. It could cost a lot of money to get back to the synergy that I already had with my 2+. plus. But, of course, bearing in mind that then the 2 plus is stuck at 2 plus, whereas the 4 plus is now, you know, 4 plus, which is essentially a 6, which is really good. Um, might as well have a skill, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Moving on. So, I'll bear that in mind, but I think the way I'm playing, I don't think we'll get as far as having a, an anything plus right now. So, don't worry about it. Too much, I guess. That was really helpful, because I didn't even know you were there. So, thank you very much. Uh, no. <clears throat> Sell it. Gold, again. Uh, what are we looking at? 7,000 already. I don't know. Not that great. <clears throat> Not necessarily that useful having another 120 on top of that. There you go. Uh, right. Because my brain was still in. You have Frost Blast mode, and I just sort of stood at <laughs> enemy staring at it, wondering why it wasn't dead. <clears throat> my voice. Oh, I've been trying to speak. People say speak up, but can't hear me. And I'm going, I can't make my voice. <laughs> it's stuck here. I don't know what's going on. It's not like I've been talking as much as... Like, pre... What? It's not like I've been talking as much as I normally would be if I've been recording all this time. And I didn't get the opportunity to record over this weekend, which is why we're a little bit behind. Um... Might as well put some money in. Let's see what this looks like. Uh, ref uh, why not? Sure. I'm just going to keep that as plus quality because mostly, to be honest, um, because we're taking 
I'm taking purple just as... It's whimsy, okay? I'm whimsically taking purple to see what happens. We have a couple of purple things now. So... You know, I'm hoping basically to get a purple primary. Um, and I've sort of gambled up front on this happening. So if it doesn't happen, I'm going to be going, what the heck? Okay, I, I put my faith in you. Excuse me! So that wasn't fun. Uh, couldn't really tell you what happened. I stomped the ground and the... Oh, right, I forgot we could do that. We did unlock something, so I was good at this game once upon a time, so that's good to know. Um, I stomped the ground and I expected the thingy to be thingy, but it wasn't. They seem to be so... They are predicting me coming down upon them, like the wrath of an angry god, and yet... I'm not noticing that, so I'm slamming into the ground and they're already attacking me. Which I think is a little bit OP, if you don't very much mind. Run away. Go out. No, whoa. The firebrand is pretty good, I'll give you that. And if we can have a fire synergy, I might not need to have a... Um, Ooh, more purples. Oh, don't forget about those, by the way. Those things you always never use. <sighs> Look. <laughs> we'll get through this game one way or another. At some point, we will actually reach the final boss and maybe beat it. I don't know. It's not... You know, it's not count our chickens before their hens. Wet hens. No! Leave me alone. I'm having great trouble, suddenly. I can't seem to roll past things. You know what? We have this for a reason. We should use it. I do think that maybe I should have kept the... Um... Oh, but now I've got the DPS buff as well. Alright, let's go with that as well. A little bit in that. Just keep it... Keep it real. I appreciate the fact that rolling through that quickly enough does not poison you. I'd also appreciate if this money was worth something. I suppose it is worth something, because the more money I have, the more opportunity I have to put into practice this idea that if there's a uh, a, a better weapon, I can re-roll it so I get my synergy back. Ow. Yeah, I definitely want to start keeping hold of my um, Frost Blast. I do find crowd control more than paramount in many situations. Although having... The, I think the Firebrand does do damage up front. Like when it hits, rather than just the damage over time from the fire. So maybe we keep the Firebrand going. Uh, and just use it better. Also, don't forget your tactics. We don't have a mutation yet that makes the tactics that good. But if you're in, if you're in trouble like this, just let them do the damage. So yeah, hmm. Finding it a little bit difficult to find the time to record. Basically, if I'm not here at the weekend, I, I don't record. <laughs> Ever. It's currently Tuesday, so I'm going to be putting this episode up immediately that I've uh, recorded it. That's an odd phrase. You find that an odd phrase? Some people will not say... Uh, like, I'm not sure what word follows immediately, if any. You can say immediately upon doing something, but... Um, I've heard people say immediately, look, why roll into that? I wanted to roll into that because I wanted this thing to die. But it's not necessarily the, necessarily the correct thing to do. Oh my gosh. By the time I have finished waffling on about this episode, we will be on a new run, <laughs> no doubt. And I will be... Look, what's the boy supposed to, what are the boys supposed to do? Run up this bloody wall and get away from the bad guy. You don't have to roll into the... You don't have to roll into the explosions. I'm throwing these like there's any reason to do so. I really believe that possibly there is not. Ancient ship, let's get out of here. Probably miss the treasure room, probably miss some cells, probably miss a scroll. Who effing cares? Let me out. You, unlock this. For each hit. That's actually really good. What do you got? For? Oh, more 11 cells. 11 more cells. So now I'm wondering if I should have taken the infantry bow for two purple weapons, one of which is close up. Hmm. Not quite in the mood for shield run yet. Let's put this on so that we have it next time. So that when we do try and do a shield run out of some insane 
you know, having a funny turn sort of moment. Um, ooh, oil. Then I will come to the the mutation dude and go, oh, that was clever. <coughs> Upgrade to plus. Electrocutes nearby enemies, generates a toxic cloud. So what is the what is the cooldown on this? Is it just a? Nah, it can't be. I see. Right? I think I see. Do I see? I don't know. Uh, no, none of those. This one, I think. So I've used vampirism. I don't really know what it does. Does it just run out, and then you? Reactivate it, or does it just stay on? Or is it one use? Who knows? Well, presumably some viewers know, because Hal at least has finished the... Hmm. I do have to drink occasionally. Hal at least has finished the water thingy. So, vampirism is now an empty thing? I do not know. This was a very... Good time to have had that skill available. Roll this way. Good. Hold on. So I might get in my HP. I don't know. Run. <laughs> wow. That, someone tell me who that laugh sounded like. <laughs> hmm. Some sort of cartoon character from... I can't think. Someone needs to tell me how vampirism works, because it's gone away, and I don't understand. Is it on? Is it active? What's the point in... I can't use that right now. Well, I know, but... So. Is it like... I have to buy it again? Do I have to talk to someone and reset it? We're all learning together, except for people who already know. Obviously. So, we will sort of leave it switched off for now, I suppose. I suppose on the other hand, we can just sort of replace it if we wanted to. It might literally be one use, and you have to find another one. I don't know. I hope not. Oh, hello, shop. Uh, like this. <laughs> Empty. It says vampirism empty three plus. Can I refill it? Regenerates in the next level. So I used it in between levels, so this doesn't count as the next level. So we could spend some money just to get it back. It says no uses. It doesn't say how many uses I would have had. Does it? No. So at some point, if we're feeling that things are going south or northwest, then we can use that try and get some HP back so it's a good way of recovering HP I suppose um, in the event that you can't recover any more XP what the heck there's nothing here just a door I can't open very well it's an exit is that the entrance is that the way I came in no have I confused myself that yes I have I've confused myself that much Oh, everyone's just saying the rudest words in the comments right now. <laughs> With a certain, you know, uh, interpretation of the passage of time. Right now, from your perspective, is when you're writing the comments going, what a complete effing noob. You've never, <laughs> I've never actually looked at the, the door that you come in through. I just sort of leave and I'll wander up. Run. Why are you not, like, teleporting? These things, I know you can teleport. When you choose not to, it's disconcerting. It's like some sort of lootsy... That's a Discord one. Who's the real person <laughs> who wrote The Art of War? Maybe it was lootsy. I can't remember. Good gracious. Um, thing, where you, you don't do what the enemy expects of you. Now I'm... Regretting taking the... Well, I guess I'm not actually regretting... Oh, not so fun. I'm not actually regretting taking the uh, purple thingies because obviously 
purple is doing me pretty oh gosh so purple's doing me fine in terms of my skills and not in terms of my mutations so i've started going for red just because we accidentally expect into a brutality build here stop rolling into the flaming golly gosh why won't you come out Get out of here! I know you can teleport, why will you not? I mean, I don't need to use vampirism yet because I haven't got enough. I haven't not got any. <laughs> I haven't not got any healings left, so I shouldn't. Yeah, that's right, yeah! Don't, don't double guess my words. That was definitely what I intended to say. I enjoy this game because eventually my mind just starts wandering. Early on like this, I have great trouble concentrating at all. I can't remember how to... No! I had no way out of that. I saw that thing attacking, and I was like, I've I got to get out of here. But I couldn't get out of there because my roll was not ready, so they hit me. <laughs> ah! Okay, let's, let's go. That wasn't a good run, but I'm, I'm back in the game. I haven't played it for more than a week. I was so effing tempted to play this game. And oh, this is the backstabby one, right? Yeah, my favourite. Oh, heck. Um, I was very tempted to play this game over and over again, but I wanted to get a new series going. I wanted to play some uh, Darkest Dungeon, which everybody is appreciating and no one is allowed to speak up against. So I thought, you know, variety is the spice of life, but I was so into this game that I just wanted to keep playing and I kind of wish I had because now I've got this weird sort of limbo episode going on where no doubt this run's going to be amazing because I've got the backstabby one which is nothing but crits the whole time and I want to go and not spend my whole day you know playing yeah can't start it I think uh, good crowd control like the ice bow plus this backstabby thing is very formidable synergy I mean, it's such a simple synergy, but you know, it's it's not a it's not a stat synergy. It's just two weapons that work really well together. I would say against one another, but that's completely the opposite of why. Um, they work so well with one another that you, you sort of don't need any further elemental synergy to go with them. If you manage to get one, then that's all grand and gravy. But you, know, you don't need it. That's what I'm saying. But you can do that. You can do that. And as long as we can keep this thing upgraded... Uh, excuse me. There we go. Ooh, hello. Bit of cash, no worries. Um, as long as we can keep these two things upgraded or replace them with upgraded versions, this is... Uh, it's just a straight up a really strong run. There's nothing else really needed. Do that. Okay. Um, I, I am being extra careful to make sure that we um, <clears throat> do pick up the cells. So I'm going to be a little slower than is possibly strictly necessary. Got a minute and a half on the clock already, and we're probably about to hit the sewers, yeah. I could, I could go the other way. I'm not gonna. It's a matter of pride, y'all. Which is not a thing I'm proud of saying, so it's sort of... It's karmaic. Didn't really get anything. Let's have a fire grenade. It's not the idealist thing, because we have... Um... We have... Yes, that's exactly what I was... I forgot I was going to say that. Let's talk about different things. We have... Uh, an ice thingy, so a fire thingy is not that great. However, we didn't find a single... <laughs> we didn't find a single scroll on that floor, so... <sighs> Okie dokie. Plus, I was actually thinking of saying it would be super great if we could find... Somehow... A... Um, uh, shots pierce the first target sort of game here because if our ice bow can freeze two things then I can attack one of them and ignore the other one which is ideal. We don't need the ice bow to do a lot of damage. We just need it to have a, 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 an arrow in it basically. However, well even then, I was going to say however we might want skills that use purple anyway so we're happy to Skill up purple, but this is not actually necessarily true. Because if our ice bow is a purely you know, functional. Ah, help. That was a shame. 
If this ice bow is a purely functional, like a utility item, its entire purpose is crowd control. Well, come back to the start somehow, without looking at the map, that's how. Um, we can put all of our points in red, because it's already doing us a splendid amount of help with our, you know, we're going to get the good mutations here too, no doubt. I, why am I so bad at navigating this game? Um, we could put all of our points in red and then the occasional one maybe in green to get the HP out of it. But, you know, we don't have to worry about like, specking weirdly, like splitting our spec between purple and red, for example, if we just don't use purple skills. That does involve us finding non-purple skills, but also we could do a complete mutation, a complete red mutations build as well. There's a grenade right there. Can I get it? And I can get it this time. Oh, life is good. Digitally yours. So we can take this. Now we've got two grenades. What's this one? Just an infantry grenade. Damage to frozen target. That's exactly what we like to see. So our... Uh, let's do that. Now, RT is just do even more damage to things that you've just shot. Easy mode. Like that. Run. This is such a much, such a much better run, <laughs> as they say in you know England. But I'm, I, I'm stuck. It wouldn't let me. You can't, you can't run down the wall. You just grip it. Well, honestly, that's kind of a no-brainer. Now we have two grenades, one of which is doing the Lord's work with ice. You just stand there for a while while those things explode. Good water. That's the other thing. You can just stop them whilst other dangers go. I did take some damage and that was silly. Um, in my defence, I thought that I would be able to get off the wall that was putting me in danger. But no, apparently that's not how this game works. So we can respec into... You no. Know, give a little respec to me. Into some... Uh... The 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 uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the grenade mutation basically, so that we don't need to worry about purple at all. If we get some skill scrolls, we will simply put it in red. <laughs> I will be happy to upgrade my assassin dagger for a replacement assassin dagger if one comes along because it doesn't currently have much more of a synergy than the fact that it's really good with crowd control. Uh, in this case, of course. We might as well go for the XP. There's no reason to make this weapon, this purple weapon does not need to do any more damage. It simply needs to freeze enemies, which is what it's doing. So who am I to complain? And if it stops doing that, we've got an ice grenade. And if we don't want to keep the ice grenade, we don't have to. It's all good. This is a this run is set up for success already, and it only takes you know it takes a certain someone like me to really squander a run properly, so let's see if we can manage that. Uh, can you not be near me? I'm, I don't want you to explode. Seems a bit rude. There we go. Probably best to run away from those. It's fighting them would be... There's, there's no heroes here. You know, apart from this guy might technically be called the hero of the... I mean, you always get heroes. Anyway, excuse me? Well, now everything changes. Colourless. HP recover per attack. 100% damage taken. Sell it. It's only 390. Do you subscribe to the notion that the price that you sell something for in a video game is related to how good the thing is in the video game? In as much as, if you don't know which one to keep, you just go ahead and try to sell them and you keep the one that is worth more. Or, do you keep the one that you prefer come what may oops I accidentally elite zombie it's okay let's do this a whole bunch fine that was actually really easy having the uh, the ice on the grenade and the fact that I remembered that I had the ice on the grenade actually really helped out so that was good That was perfect. 
Oh, also, I suppose the one thing I do need to be ooh, wary of is accidentally grabbing onto a thing and not being able to let go. And also the fact that our bow does need to be able to shoot down things that are coming right for us. In the south part way. Um, without me having to fire twice. Although it's quite fast, so it might not be a big deal. Because the reason I ask is that Nutcracker was worth 360 when I sold it. And I'm looking at it thinking... Is that entirely necessary? Like, is it? Is it that much worse? Let's compare it to this one. All right, so we're going to swap this back. I don't want it. And this is worth 170. So, the the legendary one, I'm guessing, is what it what the L stands for. Is worth roughly twice as much. Actually, a bit more than twice as much. Right? 170, 340. Oh, way out. Ramparts? No. Who do you think I am? You are. I don't want a firebrand. It's just not it's just insulting at this point. Uh, let's go and see if this treasure is not cursed. Correct. It's not cursed. And then... Uh, I mean, this is good too. Burning target. I'm going to say no. 210. Because our red um, spec is just too valuable to pass up right now. And we've got more red, so that's fine. If we get a purple-green choice, then I'm obviously going green. That's just it. Nah, don't need it. I think we're grand. Where are we going to go next? This is the weirdest shape floor. I think we want to go over there. Let's do that. <laughs> Sometimes that's very difficult to do, so I'm glad that it allows me to... Get it right. Thank you for stopping in midair just to attack that thing. Really appreciate that. We should also see if we can find somewhere new to go, based on the fact that we now have the spider climb. And also the ground stomp basically gets us to the ancient sewers. I don't know if these are always gated behind that, because I wasn't really paying that much attention. Let us see what happens. 41 cells, well done me. Impaler might be pretty good. Let's put them all in the Impaler, because if we uh, find that we want a decent melee weapon, I think you can do worse than the Impaler. You can do better than the Impaler. Uh, upgrade. Bleeding. Sure. Uh, keep that. That's fine. I don't mind re-rolling a couple of times and getting back where we were. Uh, oh. Hmm. See, I've not been really suffering from the cooldown time on the grenades. And if I've now bought a grenade that does bleeding damage to something that thaws, it might be worth using that more. Especially if I can reforge... I want to see if I can reforge the dagger to just do bleeding. Or burning. So that is this. So now we should get bleeding, bleeding, and more bleeding, burning and bleeding. That's what we've got. Uh, which which will be good. I think that'll be grand. I'm gonna take the elevator like a good boy. Good. I'm recording back onto my SSD and hoping beyond hope that the twenty point twenty point seven gigabytes that I've got left on it. Yes, I know. 20.7 is not much. I'm hoping that 20.7 gigabytes is more than enough to um, record one episode of Dead Cells. Then I'm going to upload it. Then I'm going to delete it. I might have to start doing you know, a couple of episodes just before they're due to go up. It's easier with Darkest Dungeon. That tends to time gate itself. But actually, that being said, after a while, it... Um, as you progress with the campaign, it, it gets a little bit longer and we end up splitting the episodes or just having really long episodes. I don't know which ones everyone prefers, to be honest, um, but I guess we asked that question. For the Darkest Dungeon audience, not the... You don't have a back, you bastard. Just do that. <laughs> Stop being clever about it. Right, there we go. Look, we get sadism for there being one of the enemies on fire or whatever, and more DPS for there being more than one, so... I assume that you don't get another DPS if another one is bleeding, etc. So, 
boots. It's, it's a, it doesn't stack with multiple enemies, I guess. Now I'm thinking maybe we want something that does more of a, a fire thing. Like if we freeze everything and let them get owned that way and then do the fire to them. Uh, he says, immediately getting a fire grenade which could it seems freeze other enemies. 16 seconds is actually better than 18 seconds and I think it's worth it. Now I know this is sort of a negative synergy sort of majigger and it's not the best thing in the world because our our, our burning is going to counteract our bleeding quite considerably. Don't want those. But I think that if we can inflict burning when we don't have the the opportunity to bleed or when bleeding's worn off or something like that. Yeah, that was a bit rude, to be quite honest. And I probably should have just run at the wall. Yeah, that was really good. Oh, let's go up there. Um I think we can once once the the, the ice is worn off, we can start using the fire and then the fire just gives us more sadism and it's also ground. That's really, really good. Just the, um... Ow. Yeah, of course, if everything's on fire, it does make it a little bit difficult to, uh... You know, freeze things again, so crowd control is no longer an option once things have started burning. But I think that's okay for now. You just put that in, in there for no real reason. Really appreciate the, uh... Whoops, that was my bad. Totally just completely failed to dodge that. It wasn't even me going to start complaining about the the unfairness of this bloody damn game. It's, it was fine. It was just me. Oop, nearly did that completely wrong. Jump! <laughs> okay, that time I'm going to play the game. My prerogative as the person playing it, to blame it. Also, stop being bad at the game. Also, stop going places you can easily tell are dead ends. Not worth the effort. It's Isaac rules, you know? Same flowchart as ever. Don't go to a dead end. Especially if you can see the map. Or if you know it's a dead end, maybe. <laughs> Don't go to a dead end if you can avoid it, but how are you supposed to know? In this, you can tell. Hmm. So, apart from the occasional why are you doing it wrong, this is going really well. Help. Just get rid of them. Don't want them to be here. Wish that had a back. <laughs> I can't stab you in the back if you don't have one. Ooh. A new infantry grenade. Is it better? Run. Let's have a look. 2 plus is worse than a 3. Uh, 3 is worse than a 2 plus. But let's go with the, the new meta of then upgrade your 3 and then you've got a 3 plus. So we only suffer for a while. That's one of those ones that's just set up so that you run. <laughs> if you run, you get it right. You don't have to think about that. I do like it when you don't have to think about it. Why not spend the money at this stage? We might as well get some HP out of it. We still have only one purple item, which is the trusty bow. Which has been with us since like time actually began. So can't really be that ornery about still having it. Good, that all went fine. I like the fact that things are burning, because it, oh boy, it just means that we uh, kind of have a bit less to worry about that come out of other things like that. Yeah. Anything that is kind of weak like that, just it's just done. Right? <laughs> Please prove me right by just dying instead of attacking me. How'd you put this? With your waiting around and attacking me from it's an ambush. It's a bacon tree. Chucking the grenade after all the things spawn, of course, means you get the damage on all the things and they die that much more quickly. But honestly, the cooldown on our grenades is fine right now. Hoping to catch that before it actually manages to do spikes, but it's okay. 
<laughs> An ice grenade again. I think no. We've we've come up with our ideal synergy. The ice grenade, although it seems to fit somehow and against all reason, doesn't fit. Um, it's just duplicated behaviour. You know? There's no point in in repeating a, 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 a skill when you could diversify instead. Run. I hate having to come around here and deal with these things. And they don't have a back, so I could waste a grenade on them. I think it would be a waste to use a grenade on them. Um, but sometimes it might actually be worth it, just to stop it from happening. Oh, I didn't think I could do that. I was going to say, never mind, I don't really want to be there. And then all of a sudden I was there, so... Here we go. Do, 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 do. Uh, yeah, just disturb all the bats. That's also fine. No, don't. I didn't move. As far as I know. Standing on the edges of things like that, I'm finding to be a little bit more difficult than I think is necessary. Uh, we've been this way. Where are you going? It's clearing it out. Getting cells. Don't ask questions you already know the answer to. Ow. Nice. Despite them, we have got a new sword. I don't think so. It's a nice one, but I was kind of hoping for a better amulet, if I'm being honest. And I'm not too concerned about our... Um, HP right now. I was going to say we can activate vampirism, but of course we can't. We do not have that. You stop that. Good. Can they actually attack you from close range, or do they only do that thing? I've certainly got the impression just now that it was trying to, um, trying to hit me <laughs> with tendrils or tentacles or some other mycotic. Whoa! Did you see that? Psychotic mandibles. No, that's Jaws. Man, the words... Why are words different from what they sound? Mandibles sounds like hands because... Mans. Like, man is the French for hand and we have manual and other such words they're from. So we can leave without this or we can take it and, and not leave. So I'm going to take it. Oh, a better pen. Yeah, yeah. That's really good. It means I have to go back to the stupid cells and pick them up. Um, yeah. Thousand gold for that. All right, now just don't, uh, don't screw this up. Nice. That was probably one of the hardest things for me to deal with, so the fact that I managed it. Please. <laughs> it's a bit rich, rich that it uh, punishes you twice, huh? I thought it might be one where you just run, but then I realised that I was in a pickle, so it wasn't. <laughs> Good of it to sort of have a weird 360 use of that. It's a clever level design where things come back and bite you. Also, I won, so uh, in your face, anyone who thought that that was going to be an issue for me, although it was a bit of an issue because I did take damage, I should not be taking damage from that particular game. Any more in my platforming life. It's not like I've never done platform games before. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm years old. I should be able to do platform. Oh, help! This is... Bedlam! Run away! Whew. I don't currently have, of course, um, any vampirism. Or I'll be using it, as you well know. Nice. That's what we like to see. Right, don't go down there. There's no point in killing them. Don't need to attack these. Don't engage anything you don't need to engage, basically. Which is to say, never get engaged unless it's the right thing to do. I think that 
here. Hmm. That means I'm going to have to go up here, which does not please me. That's fine. As long as things like that happen correctly every time, I don't really have a concern about it. I don't think that if you crit one thing, it also does crit damage to the things also affected by that swing. Get out of here. What? Oh, man. Seriously? So now I have to either walk back here or... Neither of those is <laughs> The other one is probably slightly closer, but in the time it takes us to teleport. Hmm. Perfect. Why didn't you arrive when I decide that it's going to be so long that I can afford to take a drink? Because my voice is broken to death. It just isn't working. I've tried doing the uh, deeper voice thing just because it usually works. I'm so glad I got out of there because I did not even see this thing. Died. Good. Some things just need to take a little bit less time to get owned. Nice. Yeah, just ignore things you don't have to fight, because I think that's probably the only way we're going to get far enough in this game to make it worth having played it. Mm. Let's keep going with the damage, my dude. Keep going with the damage. Don't take your hand off the controller, for goodness sake. We're okay. There might be something cool up there. I can't really bother going back to look for it, so... Next level, please! Oh, my goodness. It's 41 a minute episode. I told you there's a warm-up run, and then the one that lasts a blinking hour. <clears throat> 61 cells. OMG. Not really into that. My health potions heal you over time, but add 212 deeps. That's pretty decent, I think. Hmm... I don't want any of these to be opened right now. Maybe. Let's go with... Uh, let's go with being able to speak. A thousand isn't... I'm not suffering from gold, so there's really no point doing that, at least now. 15% of purchase price. Hunter's grenade. It's easier to hunt for rare blueprints. Okay, um, that might be worth doing later, right? Maybe not right now. Let's try a random starter shield because then we'd be more encouraged to do shield runs if the shield that we have available to us is not absolute gash. Also, still on Assassin's Dagger 1+. Plus. I haven't even found a shop that's likely to sell us one. Biting worms, volley of arrows, toxic cloud. Eh, it's pretty good. Fighters. Explode. Explode's pretty good. Toxic cloud. Explode. I spent all my money. Eh, fighters. I'll do. Well, there's no point in having the money. <laughs> I'm not salty about having spent all that money. Um, I, I'm kind of glad that for once we've spent more money than we've earned across the period, across the, the length of the run, to be honest with you, because most of the time we die with more than 6,000 gold and can't have it. Oh, we're going to die. <laughs> I'm not ready for this. Why are you called conjunctivitis? Do you have a back? I don't appreciate this thing. Alright, remember to roll when you land on the ground yourself. Yeah, you're not going to be critted, are you? Although the um, tentacles are, so that's good. Hi, you put your missing that. Go for here and be on the ground where the fire is. Not over there. Just take damage, will you? Come on. Hello. No. Ooh. You can dodge that. What? So being able to set it on fire. That wasn't clever. I just literally just walked into that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. I'm bad. Let's rub it in. Can you just open the gate by slamming into it? That would be much more pre ple much more pleasant for me. Yeah, 
Yeah, then see, now that they're on fire, I'm not going to be able to keep them in place long enough to do some damage to them. Oh, snap. I love how these are directly out of Day of the Tentacle, and it's not even... You know, they're not even ashamed about it. It's just, yeah, Day of the Tentacle. Radical. Alright. Saved one down. <laughs> not going too well, unfortunately. Problem here... Is... I don't want to die. So, please let me shoot you. And then do untold damage to you. Miss. Oh, I didn't quite miss. Wait, which one does damage to a frozen thing? No, no, no. Toxic cloud on that one, though. Don't mind a bit of uh, burny damage. I mean, we're going to take a while to get through this. We're only on <laughs> a few percentages. I didn't realise I was spending so much money, that was my mistake. Also, I forgot the insufferable crisp. Crisp. Crypt. Was this one. Come into range, mother trucker. Right, pay attention. Not doing well. I've only- look, I fought this boss once, and I was so excited when I succeeded that I started speaking French, so... Good thing you just completely missed me now. Because I'd be sad. Hum, hum, hum. Also, if you would be a little bit more consistent with the timing on that attack, I would much more consistently dodge it. Yeah, like that. Missed. Sadness. You stood on the thing that I... <laughs> I didn't pay enough attention to realise that there was a platform there, and so I stood on it. Oh, okay. By the way, I'm never going to be able to dodge these uh, late, late game uh, fire attacks that the bastard's got. Because kill it. Nice. Yes. Do it. Bring it on, Emotro. What? How are you so in the zone to die just now? That doesn't even make sense. Wow! You didn't even give me time to notice. Nice. I mean, we're about at the same HP, so I think we're doing quite well. Simply because that Joker <laughs> doesn't have a heal and I have one more left. So. I don't have vampirism today. You're right. It'd be a good time to have it because, of course, Every shot landed, vampirism is the name of the game there. Just throw these grenades at it all the time. What? Any tips on that would be greatly appreciated, because that's stressing me out. That shouldn't be allowed. You're not freezing anymore, which is making me sad. Okay. I, can, I can manage this one. This one's fine. Why do you keep going back somewhere so I can't reach you? That's, yes, do that. Go through the platform I'm on so I can throw a grenade at you. But not with this attack. Genuinely no idea how to avoid that. <laughs> Tried it many times. So, leave me alone. That was a, a very elegant and, you know, valiant shot. Such an arcing... Why? <laughs> Leave me alone. I, I just... I. You can't... How do you dodge it? Is there a dodge? Can you dodge that? Or is it just bullshit? It can't be just bullshit. Right? 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 That's not how this works. It's not just bullshit. There's... There's gamification to this game, right? You, you can beat it. Someone show me someone dodging every single one of these damn things. Because I am going to die, which means I can call this an episode and have some tea. Because I'm up for a cup of tea right now. Well, thank you for watching. I really need to understand that fight so much better. And the fact that it takes me that long to get there 
means that I just don't get the practice. I've beaten it once, and that was by accident with a really good run. Um, but like, this is episode, like, 10? 11? So I've not played this game that much at all. So thank you for all your support and all your hints and tips, and I hope that you'll continue to enjoy this game in the future. But until then, thanks for watching. Remember to like the video because it was amazing, and subscribe to the channel because it's amazing, and don't forget to join me for the other series too. And hopefully we'll have a nice thing to fill in the Friday slot, which I don't know what to do with you just yet, but until next time, thank you for watching, and I will see you around. Bye. All right, I can't remember how to stop it. Hang on, I have to click. Let me click. Where's the... Where's the mouse? Give me a mouse. <laughs>